Hey everyone, it's The Gadget Show, and welcome back to my channel. Today, we're going to be talking about the Google Pixel 8, Pixel 8 Pro Camera Extension, and Pixel 7. Smartphones, Google Pixel 8 and Pixel 8 Pro Camera Specification Leaks. The Google Pixel phones have always been praised for their cameras, and they're one of the best phones to get if you are looking for the best camera performance. The primary camera Pixel's sensor newest remains process remains unchanged is custom built Google with Google Pixel AI the Google and makes Pixel wide, faster and more secure, Pixels, delivering the best photo and video quality yet. Pixel 2 had IMX 362 but wasn't much different than IMX 363. But it all changed in 2021 with the launch of the Google Pixel 6 and Pixel 6 Pro, which were also the first Pixels with the Google Tensor chipset. These phones had a new design language and more importantly, upgraded camera hardware. The Pixel 6 and Pixel 6 Pro featured a 1 over 1.31, 50 megapixel Samsung GN1 sensor Time to meet camera, the next which level is a big case. upgrade over the IMX 363, the Pixel offering rear an camera almost 100% takes incredible photos in stunning light camera The same camera sensor was used in the Google Pixel 7 series, but it is all going to change once again with the Google Pixel 8 series. The Google Pixel 8 series is getting upgraded camera sensors. The biggest upgrade is the Samsung GN2 sensor for the primary camera. You give your this is a 1 over 1.12 sensor with a 1.4 micrometers pixel size. Represents all skin types. In simple words, this is a larger sensor. Now, meet the 1 over 1.12 inches for the Pixel 7 Pro. The Samsung GN1 has a larger individual pixel size. 1.4 micrometers versus 1.2 micrometers. The GN2 sensor features an upgraded PDAF technology named an Intel upgraded Pro, ultra wide offering faster that powers more accurate autofocus to make challenging situations. Another thing to note is the 8K video recording capability of the Samsung GN2 sensor. As we know via previous leaks, the Google Tensor G3 will support 8K 30fps video recording so we may finally see Google Pixels with 8K video recording. Speaking of the ultra-wide camera, Google Pixel 8 Pro is in our next generation sensor super the ultra-wide camera to close the quality even far away. IMX 737. Easily edit your photos with This is the same camera sensor that was used in the Google Pixel 7a. This is almost twice the size of the Sony IMX 386, which was used there, in the Google Pixel better. 7 Pro. Your and photos Pixel and everything else on your phone deserve multiple layers. The ultra-wide camera on the Pixel 8 Pro is also having a wider FOV, so the zoom ratio is 0.49x, compared to 0.56x on the Pixel 7 Pro. As for the vanilla model, the ultra-wide camera Body has the yet. same Sony IMX 386 sensor the next as the Pixel 7 series. But, the zoom ratio is 0.55x, compared to 0.67x in the Pixel 7. This means the field of view is wider for the vanilla Pixel 8's ultra-wide camera as well. The other two cameras on the Google Pixel 8 Pro are the same as last year, a 48 megapixel Samsung GM5 sensor with a 5x periscope lens, and an 11 megapixel Samsung 3J1 sensor with a selfie shooter. Google Pixel 8 and Pixel 8 Pro have a time of flight sensor for better focusing, but the Pixel 8 Pro has an upgraded 8x8 to and you, go, you understand the language with live translate. It the vanilla is model, read, talk, however, or type. has the same the to the point to FSTM VL50 L1 sensor as last year. And last but not least, Google Pixel 8 Pro has a fur thermometer sensor. This is a Melexis MLX90632 sensor which is used for non-contact thermal measurement. Google Pixel 8 series will get some new software features for the camera. There is a feature named Adaptive Torch that dynamically adjusts the flash intensity based on the lighting around you. Then there is Segmentation AWB, which divides the scene into various segments and then applies image processing algorithms to specific parts of the image.